What up guys, Tony Snuff here, meeting I am Tony, and all of this is Snuff. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel. Just get up off your porn, heaven spank, why are you sick, bastards? Stop listening to that sexy music, put away your ding-dong, whip out your snuff, and let's get to sniffing it. Today we are going to be doing a review on Foo Bar Willy P. Eat. But first, Nashville is having a snowstorm right now. I never thought I would see that coming. So, my mom on the phone told me how to take a cardboard box and make a sled so I could walk to the store, which was stupid and freezing. And, but I decided to play on it after I went to the store. So yeah, this was the, uh, the product of that. Don't judge me. I'm still a kid at heart, bitch ass. Anyways. So yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Um, so far it's still snowing for like the next 12 hours. So we'll see how that works out. <laughs> Anyways. Back to the snuff. All right, so Fubar Wooly Pete snuff. It comes in this crappy little plastic container. <laughs> so I'm not a fan of these, um, just because they're not good containers. Um, they get the job done, and they're small and compact, which is good. But you know they can open up in your pocket pretty easily. They don't you know keep anything as moist or anything like it is. But with that, we don't have to worry about because a Fubar Willy Pete, as you can see, is a very white snuff. Yeah. And it is a very powdery snuff. Powdier than the freaking snow that's outside. <laughs> so, yeah. And that's what that is. Um, color and consistency. White, dry as shit, and super powdery fine grind. As you saw with the... <laughs> so... Yeah, out of the plastic container. I can't even call it a tin. <laughs> it kind of smells a little bit chalky. And that's it. That's all I get from it. Like chalk. Chalky. That's it. I'm <laughs> just out of the tin. So let's get some of this up my damn nose. You know, I want to see somebody <coughs> put some of this in a snuff bullet and go <laughs> just once. See what happens to them. They'll probably cough for days. <coughs> like that. <coughs> and the bad thing is, is I very lightly sniffed it up a nostril that is completely stuffed up. And it still somehow made it past it. <coughs> Even the slightest inhale. Shoots it to the back of your throat. <coughs> so you know what I'm going to do with it? I'm just going to take what's left of my fingers, those little chunks. I'm just going to go like this. <coughs> <coughs> there we go. So just going to put it in there. Squeeze a little bit. Squeeze the nose together without breathing in. I did it while breathing in. Don't do that. Ah, much better. So once it's in my nose... I still get a chalky scent from it. And out of all honesty, from all of the super fine snuffs that I've ever used, I pretty much get the same scent from it. And I know it doesn't help that my nose is a little runny from playing outside like a fucking two-year-old. But it, it smells a little chalky. And I get a tiny, 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 like micro, like sweet scent from it just me um but that's it like a very 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 small amount of sweet and a bunch of chalk nicotine content is pretty good um that is one thing with a lot of the very finely ground snuffs i always do get decent nicotine from it the bad part is if you don't sniff it just right or put it just right in your nose then you're going to spend 20 minutes coughing and you're going to say fuck that snuff i'm never using it again um I'm not a huge user of very fine snuffs <coughs> at all. Um, like I still have in a container somewhere most of the uh, most of this one, just because I don't use them that much. Because there, it's such a pain in the ass for me to sniff. So if any of y'all have any tips on how y'all take your very super fine snuffs, let everybody know in the comment sections below on how y'all do it. If there's any connoisseurs of finely ground snuff out there. And let it let everybody know, let me know, let everybody know like how you do it, what sense you get from it, and if you enjoy it or not, or if it still makes you cough like a two year old with a cold. <laughs> um, would I recommend this snuff if you want to try a finely ground snuff? 
go for it. Maybe you'll get a different scent than I do. Um, this is just the scent that I get from most of them. Um, yeah, so I, I'd recommend trying it if you want to. If you don't like finely grown snuff, then Fubar Willy Pete is not for you. It has a damn grenade on it because it blows up your freaking lungs whenever you breathe it in too hard. So yeah, give it a shot. I'm not a fan of it. I don't, you know, I don't like finely grown snuffs like that, um, that are, you know, the so fine that they're white and you could just I'm trying to get it in the camera, very lightly breathe on it. And it does that shit. It looks like a sneeze, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so I'm not a fan of it. Um, if if you are, let us know what you get from it and why you like it in the comment sections below. Um, I also got in the mail. I'm not going to do a complete behind the snuff <laughs> for one snuff I got. But I did get in the Honeybee uh, Dry Snuff from MrSnuff.com. It just came in a separate package. I don't know why. And a day later, it was stupid. But anyways, <laughs> leave us a comment if you enjoyed this snuff, if you've tried it, if you hate it. What did you think about it in the comment sections below? And also, make sure to hit the like and subscribe buttons down here next to my boobies. And on the next Behind the Snuff, I may and or may not take the camera outside if it's still snowy. I want to do one later today whenever the snow finally stops later tonight um, just to show the snow. Because I'm sorry, I'm from Florida. I'm not used to snow. And this is redonkulous. This is crazy. So, well, to me, it's crazy. To y'all, y'all probably like, do we get snow all the time? <laughs> but anyways, thanks guys for going back to my channel. I hope you liked it. Hit the like button if you did. Make sure you subscribe. Comment sections, titties, and I'm good to go. I'll see you guys later on with another Behind the Snuff and the next Snuff review. Peace!